Hi everyone, this is Laurie and I'm with Magnolia Design Company and I wanted to bring you another project. Um, this platform uh, was just um, plain wood. I painted it in black, let it dry, did a crackle coat on top of that, let it dry, and then did a white coat. So on this, I wanted to use um, the farm truck on this, and we will get started here. This is a brand new stencil, so we will fuzz it. And I also did two coats of um, sealer on that too. And I just heard that we are getting our fuzzing towels. I think they should be out in the next week or two. So Magnolia is coming out with all kinds of uh, new accessory stencils. And you should check it out. They've got some pretty amazing uh, products. And that should be good. And we will bring this up. And making sure there's no air bubbles. And since there's a lot of open spaces, I just want to really get in there and push that down so you don't get no bleeding through with the uh, chalk paste. Now on the uh, gray, I will be using uh, the multi-tool. Um, to just get in here and do the hub. I know I don't talk much when I'm concentrating. But for the month of May, uh, Magnolia has got an unbelievable price because it would if even if you want to just try it out, it would be cheaper for you to buy the starter kit for $49 than to go in there and buy a couple products. and you'd probably be spending just as much and you get quite a bit with the starter kit. Then we're going to do the truck in red. Let's see here, let's get this one. So, let's get the red down. Tell you, any of these projects really does not take you long at all. When you're doing two tones like this, you go a little bit slower around, but they're so much fun and easy to do. And I'll get back to that around the wheel.
I was finally able to get out today and Hobby Lobby opened up and oh my gosh. They are having a really good sale right now and I went and uh, got some stuff to do some more projects so you will get to see all those. A lot of their, uh, f all their picture frames and stuff like that are 50% off and let's break that off, put that back in the thing and let's see. Peel and reveal. Oh, that is stinking cute. All right, let me go get this in the water and I will be right back. Okay, I'm back again. Instead of hitting pause, I hit stop, so I'm gonna have to put these two videos together. And let me go ahead and dry this. Now, since I did put two coats of seal, this chalk will wash off, but if you want it permanent, I wouldn't use a liquid seal. I would use a spray seal because anything too wet reactivates that chalk. So I would just lightly spray two coats on here. Get this deep fuzzed. And we will put this Getting all the bubbles, air bubbles out, and don't want the chalk to bleed through. I will do the little red hearts here first. Then I am going to use black. I didn't bring my thing of water over here, so I'll have to run over and this time pause the video and not stop it. Now peel it up. And that looks good except for one little spot there which we can clean up. So hold on just a second, let me go wash this off. 
All right. Yeah, I don't like that chalk or ink or anything staying on there. I will use a fine tip. That looks a little better. And let's get this dried. Let's get the side gate to the truck on top. this lined up. I'm not going to press on the outside, just the inside. So it doesn't stick too much to the uh, already chalked truck. Let's see here. I do not, I would like to mm, do that in a brown. Should we do that in brown? Yeah, let's do that in brown. Get this all stirred up and get those pigments stirred up in there. Okay, I th think I just really screwed up by hitting these buttons on this phone. Sometimes I thought it recorded and it didn't. And Well, let's go ahead and um, heat set this railing. Now that is really cute. I really like that. Now if it was me, I would um, spray it with uh, two real fine coats of uh, sealant. And the sealant I use, which I'm not promoting them, is the um, Mod Podge uh, spray sealer. So, and let me See if I can't get in here. Clean this up just a little bit more. There, that's better. All right, so I will have to go back and um, check the video to see what I missed. You know, it's been one of those days. So um, if you guys are interested, um, 
check out my page and and go um, check it out. So I will see you on the next project. Bye.